How you going guys, Mark here from DNA Paints. Welcome back to another video. On this one, I'll be running you through the prep and paint stages of this panel, which has been supplied to us by Autobahn in Cranbourne. This panel will be getting painted in mutant crystals with apple red and sapphire blue candy colors on over the top, and will be on display in front of the DNA Paints display at the Autobahn Cranbourne. With that said guys, let's jump into the video right now. primer was applied on this panel. I'll block sand the panel down with 240 grit and I'll be then removing those 240 scratches with 400 grit on a orbital sander. Once the panel's all prepped up and I've cleaned it with our wax and grease remover in the pressure bottle, which is available from the PTW website, I'll use our etch primer in aerosol over any rough throughs I've got from the prep stage. This will prevent any fry ups when the base coat is applied. I'll then apply four coats of the silver flare with 10 minutes between each coat. Once the silver has flashed for 10 minutes, I'll wipe the panel with mutant crystals using a chuck swipe. roughly 10 to 15 minutes for the crystals to form at 20 to 25 degrees centigrade. I'll turn the booth off for this due to constant air flowing over the panel can cause the crystals to form small and uneven. Once the crystals have formed and I'm happy with the pattern, I'll then spray three coats of over-reduced pure black over the crystal pattern. After 10 minutes, I'll then use grey scotch bright and warm water to lightly scuff the tops of the crystals, revealing the crystal and black contrast. Once dry, I'll mask off sections and apply four coats of apple red and sapphire blue candy colors over the top. And then the clear coat of choice today will be our custom clear.
Thanks for watching this one, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.